Everyone, this is a unthinkable a tragedy. Uh, we have to uh, first and foremost pray for all of those who are impacted, uh, those families. Uh, pray for our first responders and thank them, uh, all of them working together. The mayor of Baltimore is calling it an unthinkable tragedy. A massive interstate bridge collapsed in the city overnight. And this morning, a huge search and rescue operation is underway. Well, that collapse happened when a cargo ship hit the bridge, sending a large span of it crumbling into the water. The mayor described it as a staircase going down. And these are the live pictures from the scene where they currently are continuing in search and rescue mode, not search and recovery. Mm -hmm. You can see the cargo ship. Uh, right there where it hit the bridge and it came down in a matter of seconds. Several local and federal agencies, including the Coast Guard and the FBI, responding very quickly. The FBI has already ruled out terrorism as a cause of the accident. And this map giving you a better idea of where um, the area is that we are referring to. So you can see the Francis Scott Key Bridge there as it crosses the Patapsco River. It leads right to the port of Baltimore. It's a four-lane steel bridge. Rescue teams believe that there were drivers on that bridge at the time when it collapsed. It was about 1.30 uh, this morning. It's still not clear why the shipping container ran into one of the bridge's pillars, causing a large span of that bridge to buckle and then tumble right into the water. The whole collapse happening in just a few seconds. Rescue teams say several vehicles plunged into the icy waters. The state is also confirming this morning that workers were on the bridge when it collapsed. A massive operation is now underway to find those victims. Two people have been rescued so far. This continues to be a search and rescue operation. It continues to be a very dynamic operation with multiple local, state, and federal resources involved. Uh, we know that we have a long road ahead, not just in the search and rescue, but in the fallout following this. Uh, I think we appropriately have our attention on the search and rescue efforts currently uh, and just here alongside uh, our partners in the city to say that they have our full support. All shipping traffic into and out of the port of Baltimore is now suspended, but trucks are still able to access it. The governor has also declared a state of emergency.